Hey folks, if you have trouble reading the menu when you go out to a restaurant, then be sure to keep watching because today I'm gonna show you a nifty little tool that is perfect for hard to read situations. And no, it's not the flashlight. That's coming up next on Tech Talk America. Hey folks, and welcome to this short and sweet tutorial. Like many of you out there, my vision isn't quite what it used to be. Now, I'm sure a lot of you out there have used the flashlight on your phone in this type of situation, but there's another option that's even better. And I guarantee you, if you use this the next time you go out to dinner with your friends, they're all gonna be asking, how did you do that? There's this really cool accessibility feature that is built into your iPhone that allows you to make it so that when you tap on the back of your iPhone three times, you can make it perform different actions. The name of this feature is called Back Tap, and if you're following along at home, you can get to those settings just by going into settings on your iPhone, then you're gonna scroll down and tap on where it says accessibility. Next, we're gonna scroll down just a little bit and tap on the touch menu. And finally, we're gonna scroll all the way to the bottom and tap on where it says back tap. Now, technically you can create two back tap actions, one that can be triggered by a double tap, the other from a triple tap. Now, I personally avoid using double tap only because it's a little bit too easy to accidentally set off. But if we go into the menu for triple tap, what I would recommend you check out is the magnifier tool, which you will find under the accessibility category. So now when I go to triple tap on the back of my iPhone, it will automatically launch the magnifier tool. There are several handy tools that you'll find here at the bottom of this screen, and I would like to go through each of them because some of them are really cool. Before we get to that, I do want you to know that any changes you make to these settings will automatically be saved for the next time you use this tool. So let's say you want to make it so that the flashlight comes on at the same time. We can just tap on that icon, and if you keep pressing down, you'll reveal the brightness controls. So that way your flashlight comes on, but not necessarily at full blast. And everyone else at the restaurant would really appreciate that. The filters option is perfect for anyone who is dealing with color blindness or a wide variety of other vision related conditions. So for example, we can see how everything looks instantly converted to grayscale, red on black, yellow on black, yellow on blue, and a whole bunch of other options. Another handy feature is this plus symbol that you see here at the bottom, which will take a temporary photo that will not save to your phone's photo library. Let me give you an example when this feature is perfect. Let's say you're out celebrating with your friends and you want to hang on to the wine list without having to hang on to the wine list. Just take a photo using magnifier and as long as you don't tap end, where it says that here at the top left, that image will still be there the next time you launch magnifier. So you can close that app, you, maybe you check your phone, you do some messages, you do some other stuff. Hopefully you don't, hopefully your phone's in your pocket because you shouldn't be doing that stuff while you're having dinner. But then you realize your glass is empty and maybe you want another glass of bubbly. So you wanna see what your options are. Well, all you have to do is triple tap on the back of your phone again, the magnifier tool will launch, it'll resume from where it was last time, and there's that photo of the wine list, and yes, you can zoom in. How great is that? Did you hit that like button? Just checking. Folks, I do have one quick programming note before we go. I am just about to head back to Provincetown for the summer, but before that happens, I do have one more video that's gonna come out two weeks from now. And at that time, I'm gonna tell you all about the new series of videos that I'm gonna be releasing over the course of this upcoming summer. So be sure to tune in for that announcement. Thank you so much for watching everyone. This is David A. Cox with Tech Talk America. Class dismissed.